Goen Johor called Bianca Jobra's transition to Hollywood fantastic and applauded her for her outstanding accomplishment. One of the biggest names in Indian cinema who successfully made the transition to Hollywood without a question is Bianca Jobra. A few months ago, Bianca Jobra spoke about a reason to transition to Hollywood in a podcast interview with Dak Shepard. Bianca said, I was being pushed into a corner in the industry. I had people not casting me. I had beef with people. I'm not good at playing that game, so I kind of was tired of the politics and I said I needed a break. The opportunity to work in Hollywood came at the perfect time for Bianca as she was looking to work somewhere else. Bianca Chopra had said, This music thing allowed me to go into another part of the world, not crave for the movies I don't want to get, but I will be required to schmooze in certain clubs and cliques of people. It would require groveling and I had worked a long time by then that I didn't feel like I wanted to do it. Before we continue, please show some support by liking and subscribing to our channel for more content. Bianca's interview created a lot of noise around B-Town and many fans assumed that Bianca's statement was an indirect comment towards filmmaker Goran Johor. This is because there was a lot of controversy and rumours around Shah Rukh Khan reportedly having an affair with Bianca Jobra whilst being married to Gauri Khan. Allegedly, SLK faced an ultimatum from Gauri Khan and chose his marriage over Bianca Jobra. Goran Johor being a close friend to the Khan, fans assumed Goran Johor had an influence over Bianca Jobra's career by cornering and reducing her work opportunities in Bollywood. Despite these fans' assumptions and rumours, Goran did not comment on Bianca's statement. But only recently, Goran Joe spoke about Bianca Jopra's success when he attended the premiere of Kill at the Toronto International Film Festival 2023. In the interview, Goran Joe said, To see her grow from strength to strength and truly achieve the kind of success that she has on her terms and the way she has gone about it, she is always wonderful on every platform that she has ever been on, everything that she ever stands for and represents. It is fantastic. Bianca last worked with Goran Johor in 2008 with the film Dostana, which was a box office hit. What do you think of Goran's comments? Is there no tiff between the two and the fans are just assuming there are negative vibes between the two? Or is Goran actually trying to make some sort of amends with Bianca? Let us know what you think by commenting down below and thanks for watching Bollywood Smash!